Hey guys, DC Network here, coming at you with another video. So the Powerpuff Girls live action reboot titled Powerpuff has been put on hold by the CW. Apparently, after the pilot was produced, the producers and the higher-ups over at the CW decided that the pilot just wasn't good. And they decided that they actually want to completely rework the show, rework the pilot to make it something better. We actually have two quotes here from Mark Padowitz, who is the boss over at the CW. He is the head of the network. He said, the reason we do pilots is sometimes things miss. This was just a miss. We believe in the cast completely. We believe in Diablo and Heather, the writers. In this case, the pilot just didn't work. He goes on to later say, you learn things and you test things out. In this case, we felt let's take a step back and go back to the drawing board because this is a powerful property. It has engaged a lot of interest and we want to get it right before we put it out. So yeah, the Powerpuff Girls live action adaptation or reboot isn't looking too hot right now and i mean is anyone really surprised i remember when this was first announced i made a video discussing my thoughts on it and just all over the internet people weren't really happy to hear that they're trying to make a live action powerpuff girls it's interesting to me that it got to the point where the executive saw the pilot and even they thought it was bad, which which really is intriguing to me and, and makes me wonder why do they want this to happen so badly? Because usually what happens is if executives see a pilot for a show that they don't like, they just don't pick up the show and it dies there. They don't have anything else. They don't put any more money into it. That's just the end of that show. But in this case here, they must really want the Powerpuff Girls to be made in live action because... They didn't like the pilot, and they're paying money to just completely redo it, which is just very interesting to me. I mean, I remember when they first announced this, my initial reaction was, yeah, I don't think this is a great idea. I'll check it out when it comes out, because I'm curious to see what this turns into. But I did like conceptually the plot for the show where they're in their 20s. They're disillusioned by the fact that they're superheroes. I think that would fit great in an animated sequel series. I don't know why they're deciding, hey, we have this plot idea, which like I said, I think it's a good plot idea. I don't know why they're deciding, let's take this idea and put it in live action. I think this would work great as an HBO Max original, as a darker version of the Powerpuff Girls, where we see them in their 20s. Like I said before, they're disillusioned by the fact that they spent their childhood fighting crime, they're upset that they're not normal kids, and then some event would happen that I assume will bring them back into being superheroes. And you would see what happened to different characters like Mojo Jojo and all the other villains or bad guys in the Powerpuff Girls, and I think this would fit perfectly as an animated sequel series on HBO Max, but they're going down the live action route. Clearly it did not turn out well because the higher ups over at the CW want this thing to be completely redone, which is just very surprising to me. It shows that they actually care about the property, you know, they don't just want to throw out garbage and have people watch it and be criticized and have it canceled later on. They actually want it to succeed, which is good. But at the same time, it's like, you guys know that people don't want to see this. People are like, please don't do this. Why are you doing this? If you yourself then saw the pilot and were like, yeah, this isn't good, then why not just cancel it? Why is it that they want this to happen so badly? That's something that is kind of interesting to me because like I said before, generally speaking, in just the animation world in general or not even the animation world just in tv in general when a pilot fails when the executives don't like it they cancel the show they don't pick it up but in this case they saw the pilot they didn't like it and they're like hey let's redo this and make it right and then let's see if we where we can go from there anyways let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about this whole situation because it's getting a little bit interesting now that they didn't like the pilot and are redoing it Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.